Hi everyone! In this particular math video, let's learn how to solve this PSLE 2022 red, blue, yellow beads math question step by step. And hopefully, you'll be able to solve other similar fraction problems like this. Let's start by reading this math question. There were 9 red beads and some blue beads in a box. What do we know? We have two kinds of beads, agree? Red beads and blue beads. And how many of each do we have? Well, we are given that there were 9 red beads, but we don't know the number of blue beads. Let's read on to see what else we are given. After some red beads were added, the fraction of the blue beads was 2 fifth. Here, we have two very important clues. First, we know that some red beads were added, right? So this means that the number of red beads that we have at the start must have changed. And then we know the fraction of the blue beads after that. What does this 2 fifth mean? This means that out of every 5 beads, 2 of them were blue. Let's draw the model for that. Here are 5 units to represent the total number of red and blue beads. Let's label two of these units as blue beads. And this means that the rest of these units, these three units, must represent the red beads. So far so good. Next, let's see what else we are given. After 56 yellow beads were added, the fraction of blue beads was 2 9. Do you know what we should do to our model now? What happens to the number of red and blue beads after 56 yellow beads were added? Well, nothing happens, right? The number of red and blue beads are still going to be the same. Since we know that the fraction of the blue beads was 2 9th, and we already have 2 units over here to represent the blue beads, all we need to do is to make the total number of units here 9 units. Let's see. We already have 5 units here. Agree? So let's add another 4 more units to our model so that we have a total of 9 units. Because we added 4 units, this means that these 4 units should represent the 56 yellow beads that were added. Falling so far? Now let's look at what the question is asking us to solve. What was the number of red beads added? Do you know how to make use of our model to find the answer? Let's think about what we can tell from the model, okay? We know that 4 units represent 56 beads. Since we want to find the number of red beads that was added, we need to know how many red beads there were in the end. Make sense? Let's do that. First, we are going to divide 56 by 4 to find the number of bits that one unit represents. 56 divided by 4 is 14. Do you get that? Then how many units represent the red bits? Yes, we have 3 units. So let's multiply 14 by 3. And this gives us 42. Now that we know there were 42 red beads in the end, how can we find the number of red beads that was added? We know that there were 9 red beads at the start. Agree? So to find our answer, let's subtract 9 from 42. Do you get 33? If you did, great job! And this is our answer. 